brown man. Let me actually lower uh, the audio. Be a little loud. There we go. There we go. Boobies is finally here, guys. Do, 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 do. So let's get her a build. I'm gonna get off of the the common builds. I think some people will go fast forward. I'm gonna step away from the fast forward. Okay. So her active, uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna do this right. So she actually has a lot of abilities in her aura. Maximum stamina regeneration, maximum cooldown, reduction, um, maximum damage, uh, maximum damage um, reduction. She has four abilities, um, but she does release the souls with Lilith Curse. That's what it seems like. It seems like she releases the souls. Anathema. Um, you're a bit harder to possess. Costs more to possess. Um, you take less damage when depossessed. And um, your health regeneration threshold um, is up to 30%. So that means she passively heals up to 30%. Um, I do want to see how that works with Ash. Um, maybe Evil Ash's anti-heal stops her from regenerating. It would seem like that. In a quick study, as you attack with a certain uh, kind of damage, you gain stacks, and it increases that. So for some reason, for, for max quick study boosts... Yeah, that's weird. Oh, that... Uh... So we'll see how this goes. We're gonna go. Uh, we're gonna go with maximum uh, influence. Max. We're gonna get a little, little tanky. We're gonna get a little, be a little beefy. And we're gonna actually go to solo mode just to kind of get a grip of this. Alright, let's do this. I fought with Attila the Hun and Genghis Khan. This ought to be a breeze, right? <laughs> Fucking rubies! We got freeze dried mangoes here. Henrietta! This is Professor Raymond Noby. I am now certain that my recitation of the Necronomicon's passages has resurrected a Kandarian demon. Okay. I cannot rectify my error, but execution of the following instructions Aura, there you go. may yet dispel the spirit. So there's an aura here. 
The first thing you will require is a map to the lost pages of the Necronomicon and Kandarian Dagger. The pieces of this map are hidden nearby. Find them. So we gain aura effects over time. So max souls will be 55. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Gather around the light. I want everyone in plain sight. Help me kill this motherfucker. Damn. One, okay. It's still hot. I'll take it. it looks like there's gonna be a requirement for it, so let's check it out. Grab that. Okay. So she has four in melee and four in range, just like Ash. Um, a peculiar device. Right? So it's gonna be four in melee, four in ranged, uh, five in health. Um, it's not bad, five in fear, four in stamina, and then three in aura. So as she increases the aura level, she gains various effects. So you gain uh, cooldown reduction, damage reduction, and then increased damage, and increase your max souls. So let's take a look at this real quick. Let's go get some of these, uh, I'm just F here. Alright, good shit. Let's pick up. And the AI can't open boxes for me because they're shitheads, so that's fine. As unappetizing as this looks, it does the trick. And it's good to hear Lucy's voice. It's good. She should have came with Ball, unfortunately. And off we go to the hut. Evil is on the move. So, am I. so for each unit, it seems like yeah, six, and if, and we can't do it until it's fully charged. It seems like, so we still can't activate the active until uh, we get some charges off. Um, the amount of charges, I'm not quite sure, and we can't use we can't use amulets either. So that's why we we, we actually regenerate health over time. But in exchange for that, we don't use amulets. If we can't. Also, we're a dark one, so it makes sense. It makes sense we can't use uh, some Jesus. We can't have Jesus in our lives if we are part dark one. Melee people, ah, you take the kill then. Alright, so he's dying and okay, so it seems like you get a good couple of stacks. Okay, so okay. So just lit up. So ten seems to be the amount we need. Now I wanna see how much it gets. Okay, so we're just gonna do like this. Where is Arthur? There we go. Okay, so it's a channel. Okay. That's interesting. So it channels, but you're free to move while it channels. And then you burst. Okay. I can fuck with that. So it gives you time. So when you light up, they know to come to you, which is pretty useful. So like, oh shit. So you actually heal people and you have an AoE uh, shockwave. Which is not bad. I'm Let's try to get stacks. It seems like we need to at least have 10 stacks. So, our power actually decreases. So the more souls we have, 
the more we scale up. Um, but when you use your active, you release the souls that you have. So that way it goes back down. So that's interesting. Let's so some light on the situation. See, so, see, so the cooldown is done, but we can't use it. So it's actually going to be pretty beast on objectives, where you can gather souls pretty quickly. What the fuck is that? Three? Was that three souls? Per hmm. Gather around the lights. I want everyone in front. So I'm trying to see how this math works. When I first came in, it was like one. Now it's like three. So let's try to see how it goes. Nine. Okay. But they have to be in the aura range. Eleven. Yeah. Well, wow. because there's one per kill, that's weird. Some of the numbers seem a little off here. But we definitely didn't kill 13. Yeah, we definitely didn't kill 13 units right now. So the number seems a little bit off, but it seems good. So every 10 allows you to do your active, allows you to do your burst, um, but you don't scale as well. So let's try to get that off. Let's see how much it heals real quick. Okay, so, wow, that's interesting. Okay. Then maybe we can blow up prematurely. Maybe we can have some premature ejaculation going on. Let's try to... Come out of premature shit. What the hell? Bro, that's Scotty, bro. You scared the shit out of me, dude. I thought you was dead. You're fucking dead, dude. Okay, let's go. Your team has Get located the, pieces the first the map. piece of the map. A solid first step. But we do have another. So every 5F allows us to invest. It's kind of like um, Blacksmith. So we're gonna put one in health. That'll allow us to put one in aura now. So now, see, so now we gained an aura effect. So you saw that. So now we gained one aura effect. We gained cooldown. It's pretty dope. Well, let's. And these guys are aggressive, ain't they? Go to sleep, dude. But that's what I'm saying, it went right back to 13. We did not kill 13 units. So I'm rather I'm rather confused. 17. Right? Look at this shit. Look how fast it's going up. Yeah, that's why I'm that's why I'm thoroughly confused. Uh, but let's get to max. Let's get to max, and then... Uh... Evil is on the move, and so am I. Damn, her quotes are dope. I ain't gonna lie, man. I kind of missed her as Xena. But let's get... Um... Let's get up to 40. And then see how much heal that does for my boy Arthur. Arthur's out there getting his ass beat. But it's fine. We are here for the friends. For friendship. Pick up. Off we go. Yes, okay. And so you see we gain stacks. So her last perk is called uh, Quick Study. So for each um, damage that you do, with a specific damage type, you gain a stack. So if I'm shooting people, I want to gain stacks of range damage. If I'm doing melee, I want to gain stacks. There you go. Of melee damage. And for each stack, I get a 1% one, 1 buff to whatever damage type that is. So basically, the more you melee, the more melee damage you're going to do. Up, to, And then the more range damage you do. What the hell? Alright, dope. So we got 22 out of 40. Let's go to my boy Arthur. Arthur, I got you, homie. Don't even, don't even flip about it, dude. So you can release it early as well. Okay, so you can release it early and then you still keep some of your souls. You see that? So I didn't let it bleed out. So you can... Okay. So you can actually choose how much souls you sacrifice. That's not bad. Actually not bad. 
That's pretty good. Okay. So I can choose when to give up. So, okay. All right. All right, Ruby. I see you. I see you, Ruby. Let's throw some light on the situation. All right. Let's fucking grab this piece. Move the fuck on with our lives, right? Let's get the fuck up out of here, dude. Down, down. Pop, pop, pop. Pop. This is only gonna go one way. You know that part. 34 out of 40. Um, but it seems like at max you can heal quite a bit. But it does require a lot of souls. It does require probably your entire stack. Um, so her explosion can do up to 800 damage. And her heal can go up to 500. But that's probably with a fully invested, uh stack here so she's gonna be really really solid solid on objectives because there's constant spawns constant souls is on the other side I think so on objectives she's gonna be I right. walking around is gonna be a bit slower the range of the heal probably is going to be garbage as well just so she's not OP Um Busy, but Busy. We got another one here. Okay, so we should have enough to actually upgrade aura one more Motherfucker. Damn it. We're trying to test, man. Leave us be. Up be this. No. 39 out of 40. There we go. So we're not fully invested yet. So now we have five more for the aura points, which is good. And then dead end. So we should be able to finish it. I'm coming too, baby. Um, this might be trapped. God damn it! Hope it's not. Okay, we go. As unappetizing as this looks, it does the trick. It does a trick. Alright, so let's get up to Max here. Alright, off we go. Oh, okay, so it charges while you're doing your thing. Okay. So, let's, okay, so it charges while you're moving around, and then you can release it at any time. So if I burn up 45, the heal will be quite a bit. Okay, so so once you activate your active, how's it going, team? Welcome to the stream. So you guys can rewind a little bit. Um, we just used her active. So basically, you can actually charge it over time. Um, the longer you let it charge, the more effective your explosion and your heal will be. So at 45, it actually has quite a bit. Yo, machine, what's up? Gather around the light. So just like the blacksmith, you can't directly invest in aura. Um, what you have to do is spend five, then invest, spend five more, then invest in aura. Each time you invest in aura, you get a different benefit to your aura. Um, so you get cooldown with your first investment. Damage reduction with your second investment and increase of team damage at the third investment. Um, your cooldown for your active is actually quite small. It's a 55 second cooldown. Um, however, um, it does require souls. So if you don't have at least 10 souls, you can't use your active anyway. Um, so once you build up that channel for her active, um, it's gonna, it's gonna. You can actually freely move around while you're, channel while you're channeling, which is pretty good. So you freely move around, you can still fight, you can still do whatever the fuck you want to do while you're channeling the active. And then you can release it at any time by pressing the active button or by letting it fully deplete on its own. 
Um, so that's pretty dope. But be mindful that uh, the more souls you have, the more your little things scales. So it is best to choose. So see, you're collecting souls as things die in your little aura right here. Get him, baby. Get him. Ooh, I wish we had a skin for Ruby. We got Bigfoot. Come on, Bigfoot. We, we, we need Ash's dad, too. What's his name? Brock? Yeah, we need Brock in this motherfucker. Did he try the new weapons? Not yet. I'm actually going to do one more um, aura test um, with her. If I find a new weapon, that would be great. Um, we're looking now. So actually, there's a crate in here. And Ruby is not bad. Her quotes are pretty good. Um, she does require souls. So be a little mindful of how to manage that resource. Okay. So we need, uh... Okay. We're almost there. A couple more and we can invest in our aura. So we're trying to get back to maximum aura. We're gonna get the maximum amount of souls and then pop our ability. See how much that does. We're gonna let the Scotty here get beat a little bit. Um... So we're gonna see how much we do, like, relatively. I think the maximum is actually 500 heal. It's 500 heal and 800 damage. Yeah, 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 it has a high amount of dismemberment. Um, her is 90. Her, the basic, the basic bitch scythe is 90. Pop, pop. Oh, your mother's just disgusting. Pop. Oh, come on, dude, pop. There you go. 29, 29, 29 souls. And uh, we're gonna mark this guy here. So basically, you, when you activate your shit, where you at? Where you at, Scotty? Let's do it on the Scotty. Right here. So you activate it, and you can actually pop it right now, and it goes on cooldown. Right, so you see how it goes on cooldown? Um, but we didn't lose all of our souls, right? Because we popped it a little early. We, 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 we uh, what was that shit? Uh, we had a spontaneous combustion, as some of us guys say. We, we, I don't call it premature ejaculation, it's spontaneous combustion. Boop. Boop. Hey, hey, get him! Get him! There we go. Oh, there we go. So once it goes off a of cooldown, I'm gonna let all the souls drain. We're gonna see how it goes. But yeah, as things die in the aura, you get the souls, bro. And you can't use amulets, you can't carry amulets. So in exchange, she gets, um... Uh, Regeneration. She regenerates up to a point. No. Yeah, the Qs are going to be bad because only a survivor. So I'm actually going to let these guys get down. Uh, actually, let's do it. So where are we at? Oh, there we go. Yeah, everyone's going to want to play Ruby. You know what I'm saying? So it's going to be quite, uh, quite a thing here. It's not consistent, which is weird. I, I need I need to go into um I need to go into practice mode with a buddy. I need to go in customs because the souls don't seem consistent. Oh, uh, that's gonna take a lot more testing. And where are we at here? Let's get the uh, Arthur. We're off cooldown. We got five souls. And you see, you can freely walk around. You can walk around, you start the channel, you do your little hand thing, but after that you can walk around. Um, and you get a little burst. So the AoE does damage and it heals. Um, so you can actually just kind of fuck around, right? So, so at max souls is actually 50. Yeah, 50 is going to be a max souls, because you get 5 more for that last invest. 50 will be a max souls, so if you don't want to go all the way negative, you can just you can just do it every 20 souls. Every 20 souls, you can just do your little explosion, top people off. Um, 25, I think, is a 250 heal. It should be, um, because 500 is max. So it seems like it's 10 heal per soul. Yeah, it seems like it's going to be 10 heal per soul. Um, because if you collect 50 souls, and if your max heal is 50... 
No, I did not try the new game mode. I will be trying the new game mode really soon. Um, actually, I'm going to do one more burst, and then we're going to try out the new game mode. Why not, right? Because everyone's going to be wanting to play Ruby. Right? And it channels, look, it channels passively, which is really nice. And then it automatically pops when you're done. Like that. So it's a relatively short range, but it is an instant burst heal. It's not like a Cheryl heal, it's an instant burst heal. So that is pretty solid. So it seems like this is going to be... They're killing this one guy. They're killing this two guys. So it's one soul, I guess? There we go. So let's actually back out of this. We, we've toyed with her active enough. We understand the active. We understands. Um, yeah, horde mode. Hopefully, um, horde mode would have been my first guess, but I guess we have uh, Fortnite. Um, again. So, in exchange for uh, amulet perks, because she cannot use amulets, she has season survivor basic and season survivor elite, because she can't use amulets. So she's actually going to be quite a beefy character. So. So as you guys see, Soul Eater. So as you collect, um, based off the ratio, the proportion, your aura grows in effect. Um, so it's not bad. So if you get the 20% the, um, the damage reduction, along with this, you have a 30% damage reduction just walking around. So you're pretty beefy as a, as a leader, right? You're pretty beefy. And then you're going to go with this for the extra 13%. So you're going to be walking around receiving 43% less damage from a basic and 43% less damage from a, from an elite. So it gets, she's she's pretty thick. She's pretty thick. Um her damage um is not bad. I, I don't know why they gave her all of these buffs. It was like maximum damage up. She's like she has El Jefe spread, so she seems to be like maybe a counter to El Jefe, the, the inverse of Jefe. Um, but she also has stamina regeneration um, as one of her aura benefits, which is actually going to make her really disgusting because she's going to be really tanky and she has a bunch of dodges and she can balance bar, right? Because <laughs> if, you're, if your stamina regenerates 20% faster, um, that's going to be good for that balance bar chaining and staying on the objective. Um, if you guys didn't notice, she has to be nearly fully feared up all the way full before she gets possessed, thanks to Anathema. So it makes her, it puts that fear threshold up a little bit more um, than most leaders, but she does not have the fear resistance of Hefe. So Hefe straight up cannot be feared for the most part. So his anti-fear is actually a, a lot better um, than Ruby's. Ruby just has a, a, a higher fear meter, but Hefe just says fuck fear. Um, and she does not spawn with the weapon. But she does have self buffs with a quick study. The more damage you do with a certain type, the more damage you'll eventually do with that certain type of weapon. Um, and I do like how it tells you the maximum stacks, but it doesn't tell you the maximum stacks for Amanda. Amanda still doesn't have a maximum stack counter for her perk accuracy counts. Which is dumb, but we'll see. This is the build that we're gonna go with. Great influence, so that way we collect souls in our aura range. Um, we're gonna go full tank, um, full full uh, fear resistance. Um, that way we can probably stay on the point. And of course, season survivor basic and season survivor elite. Um, but that's gonna be for probably another game, because we do want to try out Splatter Royale. We have oh my god. Look, Okay, so we have all these different modes. Um, I will be trying Ruby um, when I have more people to play with. That way we can kind of lock Ruby in. Because I know a lot of the randoms are going to pick Ruby. And I don't want to fight over that shit. And then people will end up um, DCing. So I'm not going to fuck with that. Um, okay. Okay. Put your... Hey, look, boss units. Okay, so I can play as my boy Ash. Look. I can play my boy. My boy. 
I'm confused. How do I not have the gilded... Yeah, how do I not have the gilded skin? I, I should have the gilded skin. That's weird. Is it not... Wait, is it not giving me the skin? Did PlayStation fuck up again? PlayStation fucked up again. Um, it says I don't have access to the skin. But I have the season pass. Oh, right. Good job, PlayStation. Oh, that's one way to do it, I guess. What the fuck? Is oh, you can play as the pit, dude! It's pit! Look how... Look how ugly this motherfucker is. Let's select the outfit. We can't, that's right. So let's do it, let's get in. Oh, uh, I don't want to look at you. Ew, you're gross. Hang on. Let me fucking change you. Let me let me change the fucking menu character real quick. I don't want to look at that shit. All right. So we're actually going to play, and then it's a whole new mode called Splatter. And let's see how this works. So I'm actually going to wait in line for a little bit. Hopefully it's not too long. Damn, and Ruby out here looking... Look at little tones with the with them leggings like that. What is that shit? Leather? Damn. Why are you looking how you looking, Ruby? Jesus Christ. Um Actually let's look at the skill tree. For Splatter Royale. Let's look at the skill tree a little bit. So we have assassins, um, they're fast. We have marksmen, um, reduced stamina and melee damage, but they have guns. Command, okay. Holy shit! Look at this tree. Okay, okay, but it doesn't it doesn't cost that much per thing. Okay. Oh yeah, leather pants don't let. Yeah, the pussy can't breathe. Yeah, there's, there's no air going in there. It's gonna be stank. She's gonna be stanking. Um, okay. So actually, so, okay. Wow. So survivor perks. So they added survivor perks to this. Okay. So let's actually do something like... Hollow points. Okay, and they have trade-offs, right? So let's... Doop. 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 Alright, let's get all these points in. Doop. 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 Alright, let's see what we got here. Um. But it seems like a whole lot of points uh, for not much of any benefit. Um, even the 1% range damage. Look at that shit. But maybe the guns... Um, well, maybe you can't be OPs, or otherwise you'd be one-shotting every goddamn body, right? What the hell? Another hollow points. Another hollow points. Another hollow point? But what are they doing? Alright, alright, that's fine. Let's just spend a little bit. We're gonna end it at 30. Okay. Okay. One, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, we got 15 more points, guys. Uh, firm grip. Deadly from a distance. Actually, Deadly from a Distance have a, have, has a better buff than Hollow Points, right? It's 1.5. Yeah, maybe. How, how did you get so many points? Um, I dumped my Spirit Points into, the, into this shit, that's why. Um... Heavy attack damage. Dude, this is so weird. This is a weird kit here. So we're actually gonna maybe make it mixed. Um Fuck it, let's spend the rest. Let's get ten more points. Never mind. Seven more points? Uh, we definitely need to pick things up a little bit faster. I think, right? Let's... I don't know. I don't know. You really need to spend a lot of points in here. Um... Let's buff that. 
I think this is set. I think this is what we're gonna do here. And who's the marksman? Marksman. Okay. Oh, let's do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what I want to see. I'm like, yo, are we going to be set here? Are we going to... Those trees are really long and elaborate for I don't know what reason. I don't know why they're so long and elaborate. Now I got zero spirit points. Um, I might be having another one join me. <laughs> Part two of the wipeout, your SP, yeah it is. Uh, let me actually um, make a party real quick. Uh, what the hell? Where's the party shit? There we go. There we go, shit. Yeah, what's up, what's up? DJ Booty Flicks. Uh, we're doing a round of the, uh, the Splatter Royale. Um... Oh yeah, it's Battle Royale. Yeah, so I could be very quick. Yeah, it's Battle Royale. Yeah, you never played them? Uh, it's very easy to upgrade. It costs less, but it's quite a long tree, but... I... Okay. Choose your character. Choose your character! Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to see. I'm trying to look at so the marksmen. I think these are the marksmen. Oh my god, Amanda. What happened to you, baby? You looking different. Oh, you looking like a... You looking lost. Alright, uh, we're gonna go with Ruby just because. Oh, no, no. Oh, oh, no. Marksman. Okay. Okay, so you can change your class. You, get, you can be any class of any character, pretty much, right? Okay, that makes sense. Okay, that's good. Alright. Dope. I just seen some thick ass Henrietta's running around squirting titty milk at people. Yeah, I have zero spirit points now. So <laughs> I have zero, zero. Now watch me die in the first two seconds, man. Or watch me drop right in front of like one of those brawler types, and I have no no weapon, I'm just fighting it out. I'm obviously probably gonna lose that one, but imagine. And what's the okay? So the, at least then I'll show you like everybody's names in the fucking screen here. That'd be ridiculous to see like forty names. You see like freaking DJ Booty Flakes. Swiggity swoody, I'm coming for that booty. Swiggity swoody. How you doing, Savvy? That's your settings. I don't know how you do that. Yo, yo, fiddling. How do how do you change your 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 settings? What what cha what settings do you change? It should be in broadcast. It should be, yeah. It's not up to me. What the fuck? Oh, okay, so I can kind of choose. Oh, I think she got it. Okay, so I can choose where to spawn. Okay, okay, right, fuck it, we out of here. We out of here, watch this shit. I swear to God, I hope. I hope to God.
Okay. If my booty hole is, is tingling, I'm scared. Do, 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 do. Okay, so you can crouch in this mode. That's weird. Okay. Can you go? You can't go prone. Must be a camping ass motherfucker in here. No? Okay. Damn, I don't see nobody. Or I just turned off here. But you do have a fear meter, so I guess when when your fear goes up, you start screaming. Yeah. And I stick out like a sore dick because of this fucking uh pink shit. Pink hair. Yeah, they must have all moved to the fucking crate. So 21 is still alive. Let me move this camera. That, that's somebody in the car? It is! That's fine. We're you can you can fucking do your thing, bro. Don't worry about it. Is that laughter? What the fuck? Okay, so they have random deadites attack you too. I oh, probably shouldn't have shot at that guy, right? Yeah, I probably shouldn't have. Let me see. Let's go, Ruby. Nobody. Okay. Let's actually grab a fucking... Yeah, you can crouch, apparently. You can't go prone. But you have some semblance of a crouch. The fabric of time is unraveling at dead end. What the fuck does that mean? Whose time is unraveling? I don't trust this motherfucker. You put the car there as bait. You're gonna shoot me the minute I go to the car. I feel like it. I feel it in my bones. I feel it in my balls. Um, let's go. I didn't see nobody yet. Oh, motherfucker! Hey, a shimps! Alright, we got a shimps. I should probably save my ammo, too, and not let myself get caught. I, I can't tell because you, you can play as the, the basic units too, right? That's why I'm so confused. I'm like, if you can play as the units. I'm like, I can't tell if I'm killing it. God, hey, my fear is actually really high. Huh. I take it as they can see me. <laughs> or something. Fucking, we ain't scared. Let's go. Come on, rubies. Let's go, baby. We're going to take this car. I'm gonna fuck him up. Let's go. I'm gonna fuck him up. We ain't scared. Finishes on players. Oh, that's dope. 
That would be dope. That would be dope. Hang on, hang on. Yeah, we over here, niggas. Fight me. See, Ruby is the realest one. She got, she got the, the leather on. It's in settings and broadcast. Then it says uh, to let your voice be heard, I think. Wait, they just bought a large rift. Ought to be somebody in here. What is the point of the fear meter, dude? Too like in this mode. Like I couldn't, I couldn't find. That's what I'm saying. I couldn't even find a fucking. Let me get a you, knife. Knife. <laughs> dun dun dun. Maybe it just brings your. Maybe just get spotted. Damn, she sounds angry. Ugh. Ugh. Damn, bitch, she does Vulcan. Ten players left. Bet, let's go. Um... This gun has a bit more range, so that's why I went with this. Just, uh. Yeah. Hurt! Alright, let's go. Be in this to win this. Ten left. Zero kills. Yo, yo. Pacifist run! Yo, imagine if the last guy just kills himself. There's a crate. Dun dun. Give me good shit. Nine left. Bruh. And there is pink F too. Oh shit. I'm over here at one pink F. So people might be going to the fire, right? They might be going to like fires to get their fear low. So if I want to be a dickhead, you can fucking like uh, camp one. You don't see me, guys. Don't mind me. Just chilling, doing Fortnite things. <laughs> I'm still mad at put Fortnite in this game, dude. What the hell? A knife, bitch. Can't fuck with me when I got a knife. All right, let's go, team. Six left. Look at that shit. Shadow God just do it to somebody. Okay, so as long as we mind our business, we should be good, right? How's the map looking? So it seems like it's going to push around here. So what I might do in the suicidal is go there first. Right, if I go where I think the storm is going. Then I should be good, I think. That's my logic. You watch me die without doing any goddamn thing? That would be hilarious. That would be, that would be the day. I think, I think it's gonna happen. I feel like I'm gonna lose. It's my first game, so I cannot, I cannot win this by default. Oh, yeah, yeah. The storm has to come in a little bit closer, yeah. Bro, these fucking deadites, bro! 
They be staring the shit out of me. Okay. But I don't know how it's going to be in the end. I don't know what the last level looks like. Okay, so it's going to be like... Yeah, around here. What in the hell? Oh shit! Oh, never mind. It's, oh shit! Yeah, this is going deep. Hang on. Oh no. And I don't have a match. Oh fuck. That's fine. That's fine, dude. Yo, I was watching. What's this guy's name? His, his name is like I think Steel Cracker or some shit. He's like this really white dude from down south, and he like cooks shit. Like, what's up, dude? I was like, what's up, dude? All right, we got this. Get ready to die. Oh. Thought we was dead. Get ready to die, watch this. I know we're gonna die here, guys. Oh no. Wait, what happened? What the lever action? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, look into the fire. I think we can make this first before we go back in. Please don't kill the shit out of me. Like a ninja nigga. Oh, we're one with the tree. Look, we're fusing with the tree. Look, look. All right, we're good. knife I think so I'm not too sure holy shit I'm dumb as fuck okay okay what we're gonna do is go out the back Sometimes you gotta put it in the back, sometimes you gotta go out the back. So we're gonna go out the back. We ain't putting it in the back today. Um, Damn, it's getting quite small. Yeah, bitch! Run your shit. Oh, shit. Run your shit, bitch! Dun, 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 dun. There we go. All right, brown man, we here. So we're gonna hug this a little bit. So people might be running towards the circle. So I wanna hug the, the fog. 
That way I can meet people who's already there. Good shit. Yo, they thought they, they thought they were gonna get the drop on the brown man. Now someone else is watching. I'm talking all this shit. Someone's gonna do it. Dude, dude. Yeah, so you, someone pops up on the map. Yeah. It's me and one other nigga. Fuck. Oh, uh, my ass is tingling. I'm scared. Motherfuck! Yo, come on, dude. All right, we're gonna go in. It's in the house? It's probably in the house. I mean, he's already kind of safe. Damn, it's gonna suck. All right, shit. Yeah, he's already in there. Love action, bitch! No! <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <gasps> Fuck that, man. Hmm. You know what I should have done too? I should have put it in, in range damage. I put it in stamina. I should have put it in ranged. For the extra damage. I think I, I think I could have got that one if I just invested in ranged. Good game. Yo, you wanna go into standard mode, um Sammy? If not, that's fine. GG man! I I should have honestly that's what I'm thinking. If I if, if I would have invested in 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 range because I didn't use any dodges. That game. So if I put the four pink F in range, he probably he probably would have been dead. If I put the four pink F in range, because I had um, hang on, what do I have? Right, because I have. Yeah, may maybe that too. Maybe turn on the fucking flashlight. Cause that shit is cancer. But look, I, I had my stacks. You said what? Oh yeah, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, um, I almost fucked up too, you have to use the, the, the thing to change your class, yeah. So we have an extra thing here, let's put it into... Let's fuck it, let's put it into Shemp's Plus for now. Um, you said you're gonna do standard mode or no, um, Savvy? You're gonna, you're gonna oh, you're gonna do the Fortnite mode? All right, so let me so so you upgrade, um, and then what I'm going to do is start when you start. So maybe we get into the same shit. Oh no problem. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like I should have put the damn. Now I'm feeling bad. I'm feeling dumb. If I put if I would have put the four pink F in range, I would have killed him. He just killed me first because I didn't dodge. Ah, uh, I didn't even need the stamina. Fuck. Oh well, good shit. Good shit. We're gonna be cheating. Okay. How's it going, team? This is my friend. You're savvy. You changed your your fucking adjustment shit. You don't know how. 
You go to settings and broadcast. Uh, hang on, team. I'm going to help my friend out. My friend settings. Go to captures and broadcast all the way on the bottom. Uh, yep. And then you go to broadcast um, audio. And then include uh, what, what the fuck? Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on. No. No, hang on, hang on, hang on. Maybe saved accessories, sound, sound? Nah, um. Uh... Actually, yo, Finland, I think Finland got you. I think Finland said it. No, I'm saying Finland, I'm on go to settings. And there's like share settings. It says share settings selection. Okay, so it's not that. It's like share. It says share settings. Hang on. Yeah, but we should have similar sound, screen, and voice captures and broadcast. Um, that's crazy. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. Audio. Yeah. Let me see here. So let's check out some of these other trees while we're working on that. We got Commando. Commando's the, the physical one. Yeah, yeah. Isn't it? It's uh, are incredible versatile, um, but they don't lack specialization. And Butcher are the high health and melee. Okay. I'm going to stick with Marksman. Something that might be broken. Let me see the but Butcher's tree. What actually might be broken is a butcher with high health using a, like a, a distance gun because they have a lot of health to take and even if they don't do much damage, they can soak. So that's gonna be a weird that's gonna be a weird thing that I want to use. I'm, I want I want to do a, a, a butcher with a gun uh, one day. Let's use like a hunting rifle or something or like a lever action again. But that was good. That was good shit. Honestly, like that last game, I'm a little salty. Um, because I feel like I could have got that if I put the points in damage instead of, uh, fucking stamina. And let's check out our ruby build as well. Do, 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 do. Uh, as much as you need, I guess. They don't cost, like, 50 or 60, I think, is it? 60, maybe. Um, 60 levels. So let me see here. So we actually have here great influence to increase our aura range. And we're going to go bulky. So we're going to do one game of uh, Evil Fortnite. Fort Evil. Necronomicon Night. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. Um, it's just the fear thing is weird, right? Because they added the fear aspect for I don't know what reason, right? I don't know why they added fear in Spider Royale. That was that's a weird, I guess, a way to just get people killed faster, I think. But, it, but it's not bad, and I think Ruby is going to be a, a, a fairly decent tanky leader. She does have uh, as a season survivor, basic season survivor elite, along with tougher than hell, and her soul eater aura. So she's going to be an annoying character to KO, um, especially with all the buffs she gives: stamina regeneration, cooldown reduction, maximum damage increase and decrease. Is like what? It's like that's that's stupid. That's fucking insane. Um, that she can walk around with all those buffs. So they might scale some of that down. I don't know why they give a damage increase or uh, when they have Hefe. It seems like they don't really know what to do with her. Um, I'm not too sure. I don't know why she has all that. I don't know why, but it is what it is. Damn. Now. Now. Battle all sorts of infernal beings and become the ultimate commander of hell. There we go. How you holding up, Zevi?
So, so before you lock in, you have to manually change your class. After you pick your character, you can choose your class. Then you know. So you don't make the same mistake other motherfuckers did. No, after you after you choose a character, you can choose your class. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are right, you ready? It's all good. Uh, let me know when you're ready now. Bet. Well, she does have stamina reduction. She does have stamina reduction in her kit. That's what I'm saying. She literally has everything. She has stamina reduction, cooldown reduction, increased damage, decreased damage taken. She has all that in her kit. Um, which is dumb as a leader because it means she doesn't... She just shouldn't have all that. Because you have a general damage leader of Hefe already. So if she was like... If she was reducing damage and increasing um, stamina, that's fine. But she but she increases stamina. She increases cooldown reduction too. I'm like cooldown reduction, bitch. What the f why? Like why why do you increase everything? That shit does not make sense. So I don't know who the fuck thought they can make a leader that has every goddamn thing except balance bar. But she has every goddamn thing. Except, except Bounce Bar. She has an AoE explosion that does 800 damage. She has an AoE heal that heals 500, up to 500. It's dumb. It's absolutely dumb. And she doesn't scale as high in terms of damage, but once again, when you give people the extra dodge, or you give people like the cooldown reduction, it's like. I'm here. Oh, yeah? Oh. Okay, okay, you're all the way down the sleeve, leavers. Oh, there you are, my friend. All right, it's time to kill my friend, or get killed, or get killed by, or get killed by my friend. Hey, uh, circle. The circle is how you crouch, because I guess you, yeah, you don't have active abilities. So I guess they did it that way. Oh, uh, you pick a character, then. Actually, right now you can do it. You do the right stick. You change your thing. All right. Right stick. Right stick. Your right stick. You move. You look around. Stick the right stick. I think you move. Yeah. There you go. Oh my God. Are we gonna have a mark? Oh, the person doesn't matter. The class matters. You can be anything in any class. I said right stick. You don't see it? Yeah. There you go. Right, so you're good. Yeah. I, I don't know what was first. Actually, damn it. So what if... Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, fuck, what? Oh, I didn't click. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, that's fine. I'm, I'm a fucking... I'm a fucking assassin. <laughs> I fucked up. I didn't click. You can match with friends, but it's more because I think the pool is small right now. Yeah, it's not like we queued up together. Yeah, but I'm level one. I have no... Why does it say 35 or 38? Is it bugged? Do people leave? Oh, look at Ash. Look at that, my friend. Did I, Ash? <laughs> yeah, I think it's something's going on. Look at this shit. Oh, uh, don't tell me it's fucked. It's fucked. Spraying and praying. Two, two, four. Yeah, I think it's fucked. I've been hearing about like if people leave, then it's like it fucks up the lobby. Well, back to standing mode I go. I'm not dealing with this shit all day. I can deal with it later, just not on stream. <laughs> Fucking shit breaking. 
It screws the whole lobby. Yeah, it screws the whole lobby. Um, I'll see. I'm trying to wait. I'm trying to see what happens for a moment. Yeah, that's what I'm. Yeah, I'll deal with this off stream. Then it fucks up. Look at this shit. Well, we're gonna have to restart the stream because I'm streaming on PlayStation. So whenever I close the app, stream ends. So we're gonna have to restart the stream. And I'm gonna go into standard mode. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm nope. I'm leaving that shit. Nope. <laughs> All right, homie, let's go. I'll invite you. All right. Okay. This is how it's gonna go. We're both gonna try to go for Ruby. If you wanna go, if we can alternate if we can. If not, then the fucking random got it. Oh well. So for example, if I get Ruby twice, then I'm gonna have you ready to get Ruby. But I, yo, be safe team. It's all good, I'm not trying to play her all day. I don't give a shit, I'm trying to rotate. I'm trying to get my, my points in, too. Yeah, she, she needs a nerf. I don't know, man. She has a lot. She has a lot in her aura, bro. She has cooldown reduction. Uh, uh, uh. Stamina regeneration. Damage. Uh, uh. Decreasing damage taken. Why, why, why does she have all that? That's dumb. No, that's fucking dumb. She's gonna get nerfed. But, but that's the issue, though. The issue is, like, it makes certain things irrelevant. Like, it's cool, but, like, damn, bitch, why you got everything? I don't know who thought of that. I don't know who in, in retardation thought of that. It's, it's, it's almost like they said, wow, we fucked up really bad with the last DLCs. Let's make this chick really overwhelming because of the underwhelming ass blacksmith. That's what it seems like they did. That's what it seems like it did. They said, fuck that. You know what I gotta do too? I gotta play Demon on stream and get my ass beat too. That's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun to get my ass beat. And then it's Evil Dead the wait. Let's see how long his wait time is. No, no, no. When you're solo, yeah. Duos and whatnot. It's a little different. Like, it's, it's generally, I think, faster for the dolo. <coughs> Solos. I said dolo. Yeah, that'd be weird, too, because then everybody has a dagger at the end. They might add something later. I mean, for ball. Ball. Bill. For Bill. Um, but we'll see, man. Ruby's looking nice. Um, I don't know the interaction with her regeneration with Evil Ash. Though, Evil Ash had the no heal, so I'm not sure how that interaction goes. But definitely, I know for next time, when when I'm in that mode, go invest in ranged. gonna be dope damn oh no let's see how long this honestly this is also a pretty underwhelming update um yeah, it's pretty underwhelming. Um, of all, they didn't really fix anything with the book. They didn't fix. Um, they they nerfed Henrietta on book, but I think that's about it. Could be wrong. I gotta, gotta double check. Um, they gave her more health, but they also made her do less damage. But the more health, she scales down to point six five instead of point seven five, but. But I don't know. I don't know. It's not, uh... 
So it means she, she has one more hit anyway, so it does... She could potentially do one more hit, which means she can get, um... Potentially more damage in? Potentially. And then she can cancel now, too, her basic attack into the, uh, the, the flop. I take the meteor attack. Um... And, uh, what else did they do? <clears throat> cars have less health. Um, I'm fine with cars having less health. Honestly, cars... Uh, cars are interesting. It's like, I... Cars are necessary because objectives can be far away. If objectives didn't spawn, you know, 700 meters away from each other, 500, whatever, then they can hit cars. It's like a necessary evil. <laughs> You know, you can't have shit super far away and then not have cars. Like, uh, same thing for vaulting, right? You need vaulting because you have Elegos basics that can fucking harass you till the end of time. So you need the the bolts that they can't bolt. Just because of how long they can stay in, in, a, in a possessed unit. I, I tested out with Fiddlin. They can stay in them motherfuckers for a long time harassing the shit at you, even without attacking. So I was like... There's certain necessary evils, you know? There needs to be a way to defend from a fucking Plague Basic 2 and keep slap harassing you, so... If it wasn't for shit like that, then I'm, I'd, I would understand. But with Plague Bringer and, uh... Him and Elegos being, like, the top two picked for the harassment, there needs to be some, some, some kind of play to the harassment. And I wanted that book phase changed man they gotta they gotta remove that book phase too it's kind of bullshit you do good all game uh, you know what I'm gonna do on the win because I'm ignoring I'm ignoring survivors like I'd rather it be like dark ones but like super hard mode like they have less cooldowns and shit like I'm, I'm fine with that I'm fine with these motherfuckers being beefed up at the end I'm okay with the uphill battle but as long as we can engage each other on the book you're not engaging each other And damn, we're back here. The wait times. God damn it, Saber. They should have given Demon something. Uh, a, a new Demon or like a new trap. Maybe put like little lorries that stop you from vaulting in the, um, in the chest or something. Something. You motherfuckers ain't got nothing. Everyone's probably trying out the new mode too. God damn it! <clears throat> uh, I guess I'll go try the new other mode again. It's taking way too long to get into a match. Oh my god! I can't do it. I'm gonna go, but go back to the other mode. Why not? Splatter. Hopefully, I can pick my mode, pick my dude this time. Uh, yeah, you ready? Yeah, let's do it. I'm gonna give you the heads up. I was gonna leave you alone. Don't shoot me in the back. <laughs> Imagine <coughs> the teams in here. <laughs> Yo. It's gonna be really wild watching you team up. <laughs> yeah, don't imagine. Yeah, I don't know why they added a new mode, man. The player base has already got some shits going on. Doom. And we should be, watch this, so it's going to start in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 
five, four, three, two, one. Ah, fuck. <laughs> we gotta rename this game Evil Dead The Weight, bro. <clears throat> the weight is real. Yeah, they really fucked up by adding some shit. <clears throat> It's the blacksmith. Who the fuck is Philip Seymour Hoff? Oh, him. oh him. Oh, hey, dude. I almost forgot who Philip Seymour Hoffman was. But we can't even get in the game. Alright, I'm gonna try again uh, later in the evening for the stream. I will still be on Evil Dead, but I will be ending the stream because this is taking too damn long. Um, you know, be safe.